Jeez, I brought my camera to work two days in a row? What the hell? What was I doing, or is this that video where I made to talk by Coldplay? That was such a stupid video. Anyway, hi guys, welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario 2. You have no idea what I'm talking about. I'm watching this December 2005 tape as it copies onto my laptop. And, uh, not really caring too much. I sure did a lot with that camera when I first got it, though, because I first got it in November of 2005. But, and that was one of the first videos I made with it. Chomp Country. Don't attack for the first three turns. God, why is he making... Oh, these are the worst fight conditions I've ever seen for the first three fights. I'm almost better off just going ahead and beating them normally and getting some different fight conditions and fighting them a second time. Huh? Oh, man, could you imagine? Could you imagine if I actually ate that? Well, most people, I would think, know what happens by now when you eat the cake. If you eat the cake... Your partner actually eats the cake, as per usual, and then is unable to participate in the next round with you. So, we don't want that, so I'm going to take Koops in, and we're going to fight this thing able-bodied. But going three rounds against these guys without attacking, that's a problem. Beating them is not a problem, really. This is actually probably one of the easier fights out of the top ten. But when I have to sit there and take damage for three rounds, that's no good. Because these guys have pretty good offense. Don't attack for the first three rounds. you got to be kidding me. I have no idea how to dodge these guys either. Of course, I don't know how to dodge anything else in this stuff. Uh, so defend. Koops already has good defense, so now he's just got better defense. Here we go. Shite. Shite! Oh, uh, would... Would super dodging count as attacking in the first three rounds? I don't know. I don't think it would. Here we go again. Shit. Man, I cannot figure that one out. I don't know. Special? I, that wouldn't be attacking, would it? I'd rather use an item, though, because it's not nearly as time-consuming. A mushroom would bring me up to nine, but then I wouldn't be defending... Uh, what does the hot dog do again? 5 HP and 5 FP. No, I think Sweet Treat is better. Because I don't know if 5 HP is going to be enough for me to survive. And then again, I might not get 5 HP from this either. I just need 5 HP for myself. And sure, make this easy, why don't you? Shit, I missed that one. Apparently, this is how certain... There are other moves in the game that play out. <gasps> I only got four! Oh, jeez. I might die here. Okay, hang on a second. This is listed under attack. But it's not an attack. So, oh, oh my god, that was terrible. Oh, jeez. Okay, fine. Okay. That was three rounds. We survived somehow. Jeez. Holy crap. See, the thing is, when I used that other... When I used that, uh... That earthquake with Yoshi... Shit! I knew I wouldn't be able to talk and do that at the same time. That's only three. That might not be enough. Well, why don't I just... Oh, no, I can't do that. Oh, jeez. I might die here. Are you serious? They're immune to PowerShell? They're immune to PowerShell. Well, thanks a lot. <laughs> oh, my God. Well, what was this? Oh, my God. Hey, wait, what happened to him over there? Holy crap, he's dying too. Everybody's dying in here all of a sudden. Ugh! Of all the things to die at, I wouldn't have thought Chomp Country would be it. Jeez, what the hell happened to him? Oh, well, there you go. You know what, Mario? That cake was poisoned. We almost ate that thing too. If we had, gee, if we had, we'd be in big trouble. Yeah, you're telling me. Alright, let's sleep it off. 
maybe we can get some better conditions next time. Jeez, not allowed to attack for the first three turns. That's not even a fun condition. Like, that's just bullhucky is what that is. So do I have to go down and fight the Hammer Brothers again now? No. Okay, I can go straight. Okay. Well, thank you. Use no items. Now I'll show you how easy these guys actually are. Bam. If I would have gotten that Earth Tremor off right, but I was trying to talk. Yeah, because what I was saying was... Well, you know, when I used the Earthquake with Yoshi, I didn't think that counted as an attack because it was under the Items menu. So I figured by the same logic, you know, Shell Shield wouldn't count as an attack even though it was in the Attack menu. You know, for the same reason that, you know, something under Items counts as an attack, maybe something under Attack would count as Defending, I don't know. Either way, we get a second shot at this, and now we'll just finish these guys off with no problem whatsoever. Tell me I can't attack in the first three turns. What a bunch of ball sack is that? Gee, I'm ready to just waste these guys. There, see how fucking easy that is? Oh my god, man, you gotta be kidding me. Good lord. What a bunch of rotten tomatoes. So I would probably get a 14% rating on Rotten Tomatoes after that. But yeah, how'd that floor taste, mister? Here's your fight money, indeed. You give me that fight money. Girl! That's... <laughs> now if you'll excuse me. I must be going where? To the bathroom again? You gonna go to the bathroom again? Can't even think of, like, a good four-syllable thing to say to the in-the-bathroom tune. <laughs> to the in-the-bathroom tune. Like, that's actually a tune or something. Oh, don't go dark on me. I need to see... Oh my gosh, now I'm frosting donuts! Oh, I want to watch this! Oh my god, I didn't know I filmed this. Oh, this is like the end of the tape, too, isn't it? Oh, jeez. Man, I want to see what's going on over there. Boy, howdy, Gonzalez. Alrighty then, let me just see who your next opponent will be. Ranked number one in the Glitz Pit. The Coopinator. Not Rockhawk. Rockhawk is not number one. What did he just say? I, I wasn't he Did he just say I couldn't attack in the first three turns again? Because holy crap if he did. You know, why does he tell the opponents not to attack for the first three turns if it's really such a big deal? to make people sweat. Good lord. What was I about to say? I was about to say... Oh yeah, but it's the same thing on Punch-Out, the number one is not the last act. Super Macho Man is number one. Or, well... Yes, wait a minute, no. Super Macho Man is the champion. Mr. Sandman is number one. But it turns out he's like the third to the last fire. Okay, I'm gonna need to pay attention here and see what the condition is, and then see if we can go from there. Don't attack in the first three turns, you bastard. You gotta be kidding me. Alright, and we will swap. Ah, oh, nice, nice one. Nice one, Mr. Kubinator, but next time, it's not gonna make it so easy. Appeal. And shell shield. Boy, if I hadn't messed that up last time. I messed up a lot of things last time. Holy! Plus five? Really? Well, that's two rounds. Let me see, what can I do? I know what I can do. I guess that makes sense. Oh, I need to, um... Just defend. Just in case, he might attack you. Wow, that is nasty. Holy crap. It's a good thing I didn't take any damage from that, huh? Now, I wish I could jump on him, but, uh... <clears throat> he's got the spike on his head, so not exactly... Not exactly the best idea. Oh, is that Punio trying to give me a dried shroom? I saw the dried shroom, like, at the last second, but... Uh... <laughs> Dizzy attacks my miss! Well, thank God! Well, let's see, why don't we, uh... 
Let's do it. I mean, I don't, Mario doesn't need the defense. If I could put a power, if I could put a shell shield on myself, that would be something. But yeah, haha, you missed. Um, no, you can't. I wonder if I could knock him over. I don't think I could. That wouldn't exactly be fair, anyway. That would just be kind of like, you know, oh, you did it to them, so you do it to me too. Man, I'm gonna actually bring Yoshis back in here. Oh, man, I thought I had at that time. I was, like, sort of confident in that weird way that you get sometimes. Like, oh my gosh, I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna just take on the world. I'm gonna take on anyone. Oh. I can never get the flower, no matter what I do. Well, <laughs> of course, no matter what I do, does that include, like, doing it with perfect timing? Ah, uh -huh, you're dizzy. I can see why you'd be a little pissed off there. Normal hammer, that's all I got left, so here we go. Oh, but I think that'll do it. Yes! And the Koopanator goes down! Just like that. Smashing. As far as that goes, that's probably worse than the Rockhawk fight. Oh, spoilers, by the way. <laughs> we do fight Rockhawk. Mm. Girl! <laughs> Finally, I got used to saying it, and now it's over. Mario's ranking grows to one. Now, if you'll excuse me. It's, I'm number one! You're not even remotely impressed by that? You're not gonna say, like, good job or anything? Ding, ding, ding! Mail call! Think it's from our pal or the guy who hates us? I don't know. Wait, what? Peel off your posters in the lobby? What, does he want me to, like, de-promote myself? I'm not going to de-promote myself. I mean, why would I want to do that, man? I'm popular now. You know, because I'm head of the class. I'm popular. I'm a quarterback star. I'm popular. My mom says I'm a catch. Anyway, I'm... So you can peel them all off if you want to, but really, this is the only one that matters. Because this is the one that has the key behind it, and this doesn't seem to want to come off. It's all lodged in there, all pressed up against there, you know? So we got the storage key. I didn't peel off my posters! Go to the second floor of the storage room. Duh! That's where the locked door was. Stop... holding my hand. Of course, it, actually, it ends up making sense, sort of, why. Why... never mind. My god, Flurry, you're so humongous. How can I even walk past all these guys? Like, every single one of these guys is, like, probably going all ten huh! as I walk by. Can I climb this thing, I wonder? There was supposedly, like, something in one of these boxes out here that I never personally knew was there before. Yeah, last stand. How about that? Gee, that's kind of nice. <laughs> I guess I'll take it. Let's see, what's going to happen when I go in here, anyway? I think I'm going to need the, the assistance of my little pal Denzel to actually do whatever it is I need to do in there. Let's go ahead and switch him over. So if there's keys to these rooms up here, like, how's anybody else getting in and out of here? Well, I guess they would be hitting the key. They're the whole, just, never mind. I'm going to try to explain this. This is Paper Mario 2. We don't need explaining. Bam! Whoa! You gotta be kidding me! Bandy Andy and King K, they're here! They didn't disappear, they were here the whole time! Gonzalez, listen to me. <laughs> Man, don't get near the ring when no one is around. Oh, the pain! Come on, check it off, buddy. What do you mean, don't go near the ring? That sounds scary. It's just like at Magfest after everything's done. And the rooms are all empty. And, like, you know, you just think about how it was so busy. And so, whoa, what? 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 Did you see that? That was Jolene! The bitch! This is craziness! What's going on in here? Now, of course, last time I played this, I drove myself crazy trying to figure out what the hell I was supposed to do next. It's like, okay, we saw Jolene peeking in, but so... 
Where is she now? Let's go talk to Grubba? Go find Rockhawk? What the heck are you supposed to do? Turns out you're just supposed to go reserve your next match. Because that's just what it's time to do now. And eventually, through trial and error, you would figure that out, but still. <laughs> There's just really no way to know, so you kind of like, you know, have to second guess it, because you wouldn't think. Hmm. Are we ready for this, though? What's it like knowing you're so close to the top, huh? Don't get a big head, baby. You know, I'm actually a little jealous of your hammer. I mean, your skill! But forget skill, I'm gonna try harder than you and become champ anyway. Yeah, try, try. You fight on, Mr. Gonzalez, I'm gonna keep fighting too. What do you have to say now that I finally kicked your ass? You should never face me. You, should you ever face me again, you will know the pain of utter defeat. Um, no I won't. Yeah, we better take a rest. We got some big stuff coming up here. Man, I don't even want to think about the kind of crazy crap that's coming up. But here it is. I'd like to reserve a match, sir. The last match of my great career. Here, kill, kill. Well, guess what? Your next match is. Bom, bom, ba, ba, bom, ba, ba, da, 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 boom. You're up against the Dream Fight. The Kid Dynamite and Mike Tyson. Now, I want to see a fair and exciting match. So don't you let me down. You hear? Now, listen, son. In this battle, I want you to use at least one special move. With pleasure. My. God, with pleasure. Still can't believe I died to Chomp Country. So, here he comes. Time to escort us to our fight with Rockhawk. Take me there. I'm all healed up and everything. Feeling pretty primed, ready to get this thing rolling. Ah. Oh, Mr. Miyagi, where'd you get this? Buddha provide. <laughs> Daniel LaRusso, please report to Ring 3 immediately. Hey, where's Ring 3? Don't know. Well, don't you know anything you can tell me? I no get hit. Cobra Kai, Cobra Kai, when are you jerks gonna grow up? There's so many lines going through my head from that right now. Remember, you focus, power, point to come, concentrate, concentrate. You two wait here. What the f what room is this? This is like the other uh, actual minor league locker room on the other side of the thing. And it's empty. That guy said to wait. But dude, we're missing our title belt. This stinks. It does. They're out there waiting for us, man. I mean, could you imagine if Mike Tyson was up there and then Little Mac never showed up? Like, what would happen? Well, here's your answer. In modern games, you get to see these scenarios play out. It's amazing! The Feral Nuclear Reactor, that's pretty good. Feral's such a great word, even though the, that one hunt in Final Fantasy XII that you fight that has Feral in its name is so wimpy. The Feral Retriever, or whatever. There he is, wearing that crystal star again. Who dog is jammed? How you feeling, son? Your challenger's a handful. He don't want a handful of this! Uh, there's only one champ and it's me! Even if this Gonzalez most ever shows up, what's he gonna do, huh? Nothing! Great Gonzalez made it to the top of the majors faster than anyone. Why, he even got up there faster than you! You stupid hag. What do I have to say? <laughs> That's what. Who cares what this guy did to a bunch of chumps? Because now he gets rocked! Well, what are we gonna do? We're missing our match and we're stuck here in this room. Nobody's coming for us, man. Hear me? Let's go kick some tail. Yeah, let's do that. Next time. On Paper Mario 2. Oh, weak! Some punks locked us in. We're trapped in here. Ugh. Oh. Well, maybe Mario should use his egghead powers to break himself. Well, are we going to the next. Ugh. Trying to end the episode here. And Gonzalez is nowhere to be seen. Hold the phone, folks. What the hay is going on? What happened to the great Gonzalez? Huh. I'll tell you what happened. He fears the rock! Man, this ain't got nothing to do with you! You yellow ass. Look at you egg yolk ass bird. It's like you look like a bird that got aborted and brought back to life again. No, I don't even know. 
So why am I still talking over there? That tape was only supposed to be two hours long. I mean, don't tell me I got another six hour tape to copy here. Because then I can only do like one a day. I got this pile of 15 tapes on my kitchen table. I took them out of the box just so I could put the box away. I'm sick of these boxes, man. Yes! So next time on Paper Mario 2, we're gonna break out of here, and we're gonna go be a part of our match, hopefully. Hopefully they don't disqualify us for not showing up, when it wasn't even our fault that we didn't show up anyway. See you guys later.